Hey guys, it's Sharpie Gaming and welcome to another Fallout 76 related video and today I'm going to be talking about the camp, your base and nukes. So basically when, when I talk about camp, it's the construction and assembly mobile platform. So like I said in the last video, on your screen right now you can see the camp, it's a small little thing and you get out of the vault, you spend 40 bottle caps, you place that down and that literally enables you to build everything. So you can now build turrets, walls, assemblies like things that can help you defend your base but also like you can store stuff inside you can build a bed you can design it you can build a guard post you can really customize your things and a lot and you can see there there is a robot platform and that actually could be something i'll be talking in the, in the next video about robot companions but here on your screen you're gonna see that creatures are allowed to attack your base and the better your base is the more people are gonna People are going to nuke your base, attack your base, try to loot your base, and more creatures will be alarmed how good your base is and will want to try. So right here you have the Scorch Beast, and that's going to be a pretty powerful creature. That uh, You can see right there, uh, that was like a turbine, it's trying to give you energy. And obviously we need a turret, some turrets need energy, need electricity, so you're going to have to plug that in a camp. And obviously you can just plug down your camp once, you can build wherever you want related to your building site. Then you plug down a camp. And you plug in a generator and you have to connect through wires which is literally just triangle or y and you connect it is pretty easy and once you kill your creature you can actually take a picture here now let's get on to the next one atomics for peace basically like you know you're gonna need a pattern to get a nuke so like on your screen now you're gonna see people like in previous fallout they might want to come to you Hey, I want some. Want to trade? And you can obviously do this in Fallout 76. Hey, I want to trade. Let's trade. But now, instead of getting something like food, now your anyone around your map would be willing to come and get guns from you. So you're gonna pretty much need a pattern. And so e sometimes in certain quests, you might get that certain pattern. And when you get that pattern, you're able to actually activate a nuke. So right here, you can see the amazing graphics. They're actually doing. Um, a quest to get a um, to get a, a a certain piece. So you're gonna see is a it's sort of like a code. So right on your screen, R8. You need a couple of those to actually get access to a nuke. So right here, you only have one piece. You need five in total. But then you link it with people, and obviously it's your your code is not gonna be bingo, but it's gonna be something professional. And you're gonna have to go into this certain uh, building. And obviously it's gonna be part of a quest. You're gonna have to click something and then you actually get to choose exactly where you can put down your nuke and basically shit goes the fuck down. And you can nuke your friends' bases. And obviously once you nuke a place it becomes even more radiated because nuclear contamination, radiation, and now extra loot will spawn there. So instead of just destroying your enemy's base, you might wanna uh, nuke somewhere around them. And obviously it's really to destroy and right here showing you what radiation can do and it really kills things radiation and on your screen now you can see a um a deceased death claw you're gonna attack it and obviously it's gonna give you some pretty good loot so i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in my next one